tonight caught on camera. A man neighbors say is going door to door claiming to be a Duke Energy worker, but his true intentions still are not clear. We're choosing to hide the man's identity because police haven't officially said he's a suspect, but Duke Energy confirms his suspicious behavior just doesn't add up. NBC Charlotte's Brianna Harper talked to a neighbor who credits technology for helping her feel safer in this frightening scenario woman says thanks to her doorbell camera, she was able to spot that suspicious man the minute he showed up at her doorstep. She says she didn't feel comfortable opening the front door. Someone says she spoke to him through her doorbell camera to make sure that he left her property just as soon as possible. A homeowner in this West Charlotte neighborhood who wished not to show her face still wanted to share a startling first. She says she experienced just last night. Looked on my camera and I seen the guy standing there. A guy claiming to be a Duke Energy worker who she says seems suspicious, but we're blurring his face because police haven't said he's a suspect. It was strange for him to be ringing the bell around 7. I know Duke Energy don't send nobody out. Those are just a few of the reasons she says she didn't feel comfortable opening the front door, so instead she called out to the man through her doorbell camera. Take a listen. We're here following up with a notice you received in your lecture bill about the net metering program. But she told the man she never got that notice on her bill, and that's when she also noticed things just weren't adding up. He didn't show his badge or anything. Eventually, the man left her home well, sorry for you, ma'am. and continued walking around the neighborhood. That's when she says she immediately took to the neighbor's app to warn others about this suspicious situation. To let my neighbors know what's going on in the neighborhood and to be safe and not go to your doors and open your doors because that, that could be a scam, that could be anything. We checked with Duke Energy. Representatives tell us utility workers typically don't show up at your door without an appointment, and they should always have a badge and wear vests that clearly identify Duke Energy or one of their contractors. This neighbor now hoping spreading her experience can serve as a lesson to all. Talk through your phone, call the police, don't answer your doors. Duke Energy says if you do come across a suspicious situation, you can always ask for an ID or call Duke Energy and they can verify the worker for you. Brianna Harper reporting NBC Charlotte.